Hepatitis A, a booming epidemic here in Florida, but a Dirty Dining I-Team investigation uncovers the secrecy that kept the public in the dark after another worker at a local restaurant tests positive. So you haven't heard anything about hepatitis A? No. How to keep from getting it? No. It's kind of disgusting, the lack of information. I think that the county definitely needs to let everyone know about it. These Pinellas County residents say they know very little about hepatitis A, even as the epidemic surges in the Bay Area. A health advisory declared for all of Florida. Florida currently has more than 1,200 cases reported between January 2018 and April 6 of 2019. And we've been warning you about this highly contagious liver infection for a while. The hepatitis A virus is usually spread when a person unknowingly ingests the virus from objects, food or drinks that have been contaminated with small, undetected amounts of stool from an infected person. In January, a special Dirty Dining I-Team investigation uncovered the Hillsborough County Health Director announced an employee at Hamburger Mary's in Ybor City tested positive for hepatitis A, but never told the public about four other restaurants with infected workers. But you yourself called it an epidemic. It is. Now we uncovered a server at Hella's restaurant tested positive for hepatitis A in March, and Pinellas County kept it a secret. It's a pride thing. I've never gotten anybody sick in my entire life doing this. Michael Scott has been a cook for over 30 years, most recently at Hella's in Tarpon Springs, when he got a call from the health department. They told me that I'd been uh, exposed to hepatitis A. There was a person that worked at Hella's who had contracted hepatitis A in the time frame that I worked there. We obtained this email showing the Pinellas County Health Department contacted the state on March 14th requesting a joint investigation at Hella's restaurant after, quote, a positive case of hepatitis A has been identified as a server at the restaurant. But the Pinellas County Health Department would not talk about it. Do you think the county is doing enough to educate the public? <laughs> Probably not, because if I don't know that much about it, it'd be good for myself as a consumer or as a person on the street to know more about it. Even though the county has more than one-third of all the cases in the Bay Area, two years ago, Pinellas had no cases. But last year, more than 100 infections were reported. Now, over 200 new confirmed cases in just the last four months. Michael says the restaurant never warned him. But the owner says when he learned about the case, quote, we told our staff they could receive free hepatitis A shots, and we even had the health department come to our offices to make it as easy as possible for our employees to get their shots. Michael says he's also angry the county never told the public. Hundreds of people coming in and out of that door every day. Um, not a million. You know. But other counties are working to be transparent. As you know, we're experiencing an outbreak of hepatitis A. Martin County holding a news conference last month. As you know, we've had uh, 19 cases in Martin County, three deaths. This is very serious. And promising even more information to come. To Martin County residents, I want to assure you that we are committed and diligently working to investigate the cause of these local hepatitis A infections, and we will leave no stone unturned. We asked to speak with the Pinellas County Health Where's Director, but his spokeswoman refused. Well, when I have called and left messages and emailed, you don't respond. That spokeswoman, Maggie Hall, referring us to the state. I did respond. I said, call Tallahassee. But there's no one to speak on camera about what you're doing no. to protect the people of Pinellas? No. But even face to face, she would not discuss it. Why can't you tell us what you're doing to educate the Thank public? You. Thank you. There's a third of the cases of hepatitis A in the state right here in Pinellas County. That spokeswoman later emailed to say Pinellas County is educating the public with an advertisement on a bus and a PSA running on Spectrum. The department says it's also offering free hepatitis A vaccines. To see Hella's full statement and the number of hep A cases in your county, go to abcactionnews.com slash it.